Boston to back home, the Super Bowl business boom is affecting local restaurants known for serving game day staples. 10 News reporter Taj Simmons visited a Roanoke restaurant with a thing for wings to see how they're preparing. The biggest football game of the year always means a constant craving for chicken wings. It's bedlam. Everybody wants wings. Everybody wants to come watch football. The Saturday before the Super Bowl, the phone rang all day. I think I heard it in my sleep that night. According to the National Chicken Council, Americans will chow down on more than 1.3 billion chicken wings this weekend. And Roanoke's All Sports Cafe says more wings will fly out of stores for the Super Bowl than any other weekend of the year. I, I wouldn't be surprised if we did somewhere around five, six, ten thousand wings. I mean, it, I, I would not be surprised. The restaurant is stocking so many wings to keep up with demand. They're parking a truck like this in the parking lot because they won't all fit in the kitchen. We'll actually have people call the day of and want to get a hundred wings and you know, you have to turn them away because we have a book for pre-orders. Just regular hot sauce, I mean, that's how it comes. The rush has already started as customers have called in massive orders in advance of the big day. But just like the coaches on the sidelines, the restaurant has spent months perfecting their championship playbook. We've been helping the kitchen out by, you know, portioning out those ranches, blue cheeses, you know, helping them make wing sauces and stuff like that. All Sports' kitchen is ready to cook chicken nonstop once kickoff happens. And the grill will still be fired up long after the final whistle blows. In Roanoke City, Taj Simmons, 10 News, working for you.